time for another youth video report, so... Hey guys, hope everybody's having a great day today. Uh, we are going to continue in uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 13, the love chapter. Today we are in verse 6, and we'll just go ahead and read it. It says that love does not rejoice in unrighteousness, but rejoices with the truth. Now, if you've ever been in a situation where you saw somebody get what they deserve, and you know what I mean, Somebody has been harassing someone. Someone has been doing, just been guilty of doing things that they shouldn't be doing. And all of a sudden, the tables get turned, and then they are facing a similar situation to what they were inflicting on other people. And the first thing that I know I, we shouldn't, but the first thing we, a lot of us think, including myself, is they just got what they deserve. But, and that might be true, okay? But that's according to what, you know, the vengeance is mine, says the Lord. Not for us. And it's certainly not for us to rejoice in somebody else's suffering just because we think that that's something that they deserve. And if we really have the love that Paul is talking about here in our hearts that comes from God, we won't be rejoicing in somebody else's suffering. Uh, we can certainly acknowledge the fact that, yes, you know, they maybe they did you know have that coming to them it's not karma as as people like to say it's not accidental just sometimes when we make bad choices we do have to face some consequences because of those bad choices and before you get ready to rejoice in somebody else's suffering you better think about the fact that you know what do you want to happen when when a similar thing happens to you because we all make choices sometimes that are not wise and we have to suffer consequences I like to think that if that happens to me, that people around me, even if even if I've been the person that has inflicted some sort of you know pain or 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 something uncomfortable to them, they would still want to pray for me and try to lift me up instead of trying to tear me down or saying, well, that just that's what Jimmy deserves, and so therefore I'm just you know, he's just going to have to suffer through that. Doesn't mean that you bail anybody out when, because. That wouldn't help them at all. He wouldn't learn the lesson, but we can certainly comfort them and pray for them in the situations that they may be going through. Sometimes that there's it's no fault of anybody's, and we certainly uh, need to lift those people up because we know we're going to be in situations like that sometimes, and we we would like to know there are people out there that would pray for us and be willing uh, to lift us up. And he says, "Rejoices with the truth." being about the truth, being about that which, you know, is is of God, the truth of God, and not being deceptive. We know that the devil is the author of all lies, and so we don't want to be around anything that has to do with that. Sometimes it's kind of dicey. I see some things sometimes. Uh, people ask me, like, well, if I just withhold certain things, is that lying? Yeah, it can be, especially when you know that, that you know, if you uh, are withholding something, it could help another person or it'd be something that they need to do. Or if you're hiding something, maybe something that you have done, then you, you kind of know that you're wrong in that area. So anyway, rejoicing with the truth, even when the truth is sometimes not very comfortable if it's about ourselves and something we've done. Anyway, guys, hope this helps you. Uh, tomorrow we'll finish up. Um, we'll do, ver uh, well, tomorrow we'll do verse eight and then we'll finish up with, um, excuse me, Tomorrow we'll finish up with verse 7, and then we'll finish with verse 8. So anyway, guys, have a great day. God bless you, and I, I just hope that you go back and read some of these things and go through them yourselves and to gain a better understanding. Have a great day. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.